Use continuity to evaluate the limit. Focusing on the numerator, we can see that it is continuous on its domain. That is, it's continuous on 0 to infinity. If we look at the denominator, we can see that it is continuous and non-zero on negative 8 to infinity. Now if we look at the quotient, the quotient is continuous on 0 to infinity. With this information, we can now look at the limit. The limit as x approaches 1 of 8 plus the square root of x over 8 plus x. Since it's continuous on 0 to infinity and we're looking at 1, we can plug in the 1. 8 plus the square root of 1 over 8 plus 1, that is 9 over 9, or 1.